We are back live, Terrell Thomas. And I'm Brandon Trish. And we are out here closing up today's show. These Urban Times on Live Hip Hop Daily presents Sideline Stories. So we needed to do a little sneaker talk. We needed to get into the sneaker realm and talk about what's jumping off in the sneaker realm. And something dope that we saw, you know, you sent it to me the other day. I'm like, wow, these things are going to be amazing. We know what LeBron James is doing with the LeBron 16s. Right, right. Whole bunch of different color schemes and a lot of things jumping off with that. But we have the LeBron 16, I promise, that'll be hitting the streets real soon. Pretty much a black base sneaker, but the sole with unanimous different colors. They're orange, they're blue, Ooh, they're yellow, green. yeah, yeah, yeah. A bunch of different dope things going on. What are your thoughts on these I promise LeBron 16s that'll be dropping soon? I think it's cold. I like what they are right, are right now, what they're doing with the 16s. I'm a fan of them already. I saw, uh, I was in the mall today and I saw the uh, the breads. And I looked at them, and you know you gotta look at them in your face <laughs> and get a good grasp of them. I'm like, all right, you're cold. And I looked at the back of them, and I saw the, the eyes they're doing with the, uh, from the Miami game, I mean, for the Boston series. So I was like, they definitely putting some work with these 16s. And uh, the back of it, they got We Are Family. Yeah, as you as you can see on the, on the, the yeah. whole base of it, it's they pretty the, much black. It's cold. Got a boy. whole black base. Them, them but shoes. The sole are a bunch of different colors. We'll let you get a, be- a better view of with the, the sole. With, so with, with the whole lows, uh, the, 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 the back of the shoe is cold. Like, the We Are Family, like, I don't know how they got enough space in the back of the shoe to, to write all that on the back of them, but I like what they're doing with the 16s. As as for me, my my favorite portion of it is pretty much just the whole bottom layer. You know, I, I like the I like the sole as you mentioned and what and what they're doing. And they said the sneaks were inspired by some of the students of right. LeBron School. So this would be pretty dope to be dropping later on. But as you see, I'm loving this all uh, the the black. I'm loving what they're doing as you mentioned with the LeBron 16s. But, Something pretty dope right there. But did you have you seen what they're doing? Uh, the first night, the first yeah, games? Yeah, 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 The we'll, Kings? We'll talk about them as we get closer. Ooh, Those Kings, cold. maroon color with yeah. the cheetah in the back. Them things cold, We'll bro. talk about them pretty soon. 185 185 will be the retail price. There's no these, date yet. I don't know what the date is. Don't ask me. I don't know what the date is. They'll, they'll put it out soon. And, and continuing on this sneak around, Jordan made a big splash recently. Jordan made a big splash with the Jordan 33s. Now, not bad. They, yeah, they're not bad. They they're released bad. a whole bunch of colorways for the Jordan 33s. Space Jam colorway, South Beach colorway, all black colorway. They even took it back to some of the colorways of the threes, mm-hmm. different uh, variations of the Jordan 33s. What are your thoughts on them? At first, my first time, I was like, ah, I wasn't really feeling them. But I think, you know, like, that's just the first the first shoe they show. I was like, that's kind of trash. But once you start seeing different colors and then you start seeing, like, there's no shoe strings with them, I was like, okay, it's kind of different. So they, I guess they try to get with the times. They get they get away they getting away from the fly nets and all this. And there's no shoe strings. I guess it's new wave now. So I mean I see some of the players have been wearing them at uh, media days. Victor Oladipo. Victor Oladipo wear. Mike Conley had them on. Uh, I guess uh, uh, had the Hornets team had them on. So you just had to see the different colorways to get a little gris, uh, a grasp of them. Now would I wear them? Probably not. <laughs> but they they are those shoes to look at. But I don't mean I was depending on the price. I might, if the price is if the price is cool, I'll buy them. As you see, you can see different colorways lined up right here. You got different colorways lined up. I'm loving pretty much what they're doing. You got the all black ones. Those are pretty much kind of my favorite as of right now. Right, right. I like the Jordan sign that's on the tongue. I also like how on the back of them it says Nike Air, taking us back to some of the classic Michael Jordans and Jordan sneaks. I do like, you know, I wasn't the biggest fan of the recent grapes that came out, the the Will Smith grapes that didn't have the laces in them. I'm like, ah, you know, the, those things. I, I need, I need, I need laces in my sneakers. I need laces in my sneaks. So I like, I like, I like what Jordan is doing with this new lineup right here with the Jordan 33s. I believe they're gonna be about two hundred dollars. So that's not, you that's, know, that's, that's not that's too a stand, bad. That's not a too far price. off. That's the LeBrons, price. they'll be one eighty-five and whatnot. And as you see, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a variety of, of different colorways. They, you know, they they stick into the script with these Jordans right here. They, they so I like what they got to do, what they got going on. I'm interested to see what some of the PEs will look like this year. So I seen, uh, I seen the ones they did for uh, Lamarcus Aldridge had his, uh, his logo on the tongue. And uh, I see what they did Kawhi is they put the claw on them. I say, so the PEs might be kind of cold. I mean, I just don't know if I will wear them, but for the players, player wise, I mean, they got to be a comfortable shoe because, you know what I'm saying, players ain't going to play no comfortable shoe they don't like. I respect that. I respect yeah, that. Yeah. We'll have a lot more sneaker news coming your way. You can check it out on These Urban Times and also let them know where they can check out sneaker news coming your way. Hey, man, you know, we're we doing sneaker news at uh, Kings Kicks ATL. That's K I N G K I C K Z. 
ATL. Follow all the news. I'm putting all the sneakers news up there, all the custom key, uh, cleats from your favorite NFL players. We're just doing some things out there. Me and my man, we got some things going brewing. We're brewing. Just stay tuned. The NBA season is right around the corner, so we'll be giving you a lot of sneaker news as the NBA season gets closer. It's been a great show. Once again, shout out to Emmanuel Glaze and Phil Hutchins for coming through. Shout out to Craig for being here with us as usual. Make sure you continue to follow everything that's going on here at the studio. Plenty of great shows Monday through Sunday. Something's going on, so make sure you follow www livehiphopdaily.tv also follow social media live hip hop daily follow me directly eldorado 2452 and follow me at ceo trisha is ceo t r i c h e all the news all everything we got we got some things brewing up man support us we're gonna keep brewing we appreciate the support tune in next thursday for another live show until then peace and blessings have a great evening peace